Hey guys, Dennis Machina here. First off, I want to wish you guys a very happy Halloween and thank you for hanging out today's reaction because as a request from Miguel Gordello, this is Honest Trailers, Batman the Animated Series. But before we go any further, please like, share, and subscribe because I put out new videos every single day and every little bit of support helps. And speaking of that, I am going to be a part of a charity live stream this Saturday, so if you would like to help out and donate, link will be in the description below. And with that being said, hmm, wait a minute. I feel like something's missing. Today's Halloween. And Batman is a DC character. Hmm. Oh! I got it! No, this isn't it. No, that's not it either. Oh! This is much better. Oh, with that being said, let go! Oh, snap. Lots of requests for this one. Before he was swole, before he was existentially depressed, <laughs> and before he was a cartoon. Never leave the cave without him. He was a swole, existentially depressed, literal cartoon in... Batman, the animated series. <laughs> I already love where this is going. Return to a time when pop culture wasn't oversaturated with superheroes. They sell t-shirts of me. I've become a cliche. Animation still ruled after school. Animaniacs! And dial-up internet give us a few precious minutes offline. Yay. <laughs> yep, kids, we didn't actually have the internet the way it was back then, but back then it was 56K, you had to use telephone. It was so awkward. As illustrated here. This, this is exactly what this is. Exactly. And spend some time with Kevin Conroy's iconic Bruce Wayne. An industrialist with the money of Tony Stark and the fashion sense of Dwight Schrute. But when night falls, this punchaholic will become the Batman. The world's greatest detective. Who's also the world's greatest ninja. <laughs> Greatest hacker. I've accessed Gotham's electrical mainframe. Greatest ever. Because he was I'm the man. The link now. Greatest magician. <clears throat> You've got the makings of a great magician. And the greatest ventriloquist? When I studied with Zatara the magician, he taught me about ventriloquism. Wow, this Batman does a lot. But sure does he does. Dance. Oh, Jesus, Adam West. This game is in Crusading Solo. He has a whole cave full of allies, like Alfred Pennyworth, butler mm -hmm. of Batman, but king of sick burns. Clayface is losing his integrity. I wasn't aware that he ever had any to begin with. Oh, burn! Robin, the boy wonder, as in, boy, I wonder what screwed him up between this show and Titans. Yahoo! Batgirl, a college kid whose relationship with bats is super creepy after you've seen the Killing Joke movie. Barbara, yeah. You've grown. Thinking yeah. about it now. And Commissioner Gordon, a humble civil servant tormented by a billionaire psychopath determined to drive him insane. Batman. Busy night. <gasps> Helen, get me. We need to talk. So they give that man a heart attack. <laughs> Nick was making a comeback. <laughs> oh. oh my god. <laughs> Come on, give him a break, Bats. We all Seriously. know you're a ninja. You don't have to keep proving it to Grandpa Cop, all right? Jeez. Together, they'll protect Gotham, a city trapped somewhere between 1932 and 1992. A town where the crime is up, the nights are long, and the people are rectangles. It's a city under siege from the best rogues gallery in animation <laughs> history, featuring character-defining portrayals of Two-Face. You're talking to the wrong Harvey. <laughs> Mr. Freeze. To never again walk on a summer's day with a hot wind in your face and a warm hand to hold. Harley Quinn. Harley Quinn, pleased to meet ya. The best Joker ever. Yeah, I said True. it. True. <laughs> Mark Hamill is the man. And a bad menagerie's worth of animals. <laughs> this is what it was like, kids. The good old days. Jeez, Batman. Maybe you should stick to something less threatening, like a penguin. Now, yeah, Florida. you would think. Nice shot. We did it. 
also light up the bat signal and revisit the highs. I am vengeance. I am the knight. I am Batman. And the lows. You've made her a monster. I believe she would disagree. Of the darkest adaptation of Batman ever made. Mm -hmm. Literally the darkest. Because they drew it on black paper. That yep. wasn't afraid to hit kids with complex philosophy. Santayana says that those who forget the past are condemned to repeat it. Then, oh, breaking snap. up with a guy kicking a werewolf in the face. If it's a fight you're looking for, try starting one with me. See, oh! that's all we want. A definitive portrait of a beloved character that balances multiple tones across dozens of hours that can only happen with a perfect creative team and lands at the perfect time in the cultural zeitgeist. Is that so hard? Starring. Hygiene-related insults. Listen up, scumwad. Here's how it works. Fall. <laughs> oh, oh. scum bucket. Too late, dirt bag. Breaking and entering. What do you want? Has Professor Crane lost his appetite? <laughs> Who's back there? Giving you. everybody a heart attack. Just terrible marksmanship. I mean, to be fair, that's an every action movie ever. Maniacal laughter. <laughs> Damn. I didn't realize it was so. <laughs> oh my god. Batman's O face. <gasps> Gas attacks. Gas attack. And looking back at it now, I didn't realize they used Gotham so much exploding. of the same stuff as overusing. Overusing the laugh, overusing the <gasps> overusing the gas, overusing the explosions. God, they overuse the fuck out of everything. Stop shooting, you lunatic! We're sitting on a powder tank! And Batman thumbs up dot Jeff. Nope, the other one. That's the one. This Batman forever. Okay, we need to talk about the intro for a sec. Has anyone else noticed that the crooks are just two guys who happen to be walking past the bank at night? Then when mm -hmm. the entrance explodes, they run away like any sane person would do? They don't even have any loot on them. Sure, fine, they pull guns on Batman, but for all they know, he's the psycho going around blowing up banks. And Batman True. doesn't know who did it either. He had to drive there. But does that stop him from beating the crap out of him and leaving him for the cops without any evidence to convict him on? This is why vigilantes are a bad idea, you guys. Candyman five times into a mirror. Spooky, scary skeletons send shivers down my spine. Who will survive, and what will be left of them? Eyes, lungs, pancreas, so many snacks, so little time. <laughs> oh my god. Obviously, looking back at it, like I said, I didn't realize they overused everything as much as they did. I still enjoyed the hell out of it when I was a kid, though, and probably would now as well. Probably look at it more of a, an ironic point of view, I guess you could say. I'm not even sure that's the right word. Either way, this was fun. I enjoyed it. Thank you so much, Miguel, for the request to watch this. And please like this video if you enjoyed my reaction. You enjoyed my Green Arrow cosplay. Oh, can't believe I totally forgot my uh, gloves. That's great. Please leave a like if you think I'm an idiot. Comment down below. Uh, let me know if there are any future videos you'd like to see uh, me react to. Share this video. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Ring the notification bell to put out new videos every single day. Fix this stupid thing. <laughs> and I'll see you guys next time.